How's it going guys, my name is Dom and today I'll be showing you how to use the text decoration color CSS3 property. So it's very cool and it allows you to basically just add a color to your text decoration effects. For example, uh, the underline, the line through and the overline uh, effects, you can add color to these. So here we have some decode text on the screen. Um, so we're going to add a underline to this and change the color of that underline. So in the HTML source code, we can view this right here. We have a span with a class of text and some, you know, one rule font size for that text. We're going to add a new rule to this class called text decoration and give it a value of underline. We'll save that one, refresh the browser, and we see we get a simple black underline. Let's make that underline blue. In the code, we can just go down here and say text decoration color. Where is it? There it is. And give it a color of blue. We can now save this, refresh, and we get blue. Very sick. Now, we can also do something like this, where we can uh, get rid of decode and instead put down something like, I don't know, $5. Then, using the text decoration value, we'll just change this to uh, line through and then give it a color of red. We'll save this one, refresh, and we see we get one of these little, like, you know, uh, prices slashed or discounted effects on prices in your apps simply using CSS. Now, this unfortunately isn't supported in Internet Explorer or Edge just yet. It's December 2017 and it's not supported. Maybe in future, you know, when you're watching this, it might be supported. But right now, double check its compatibility in Edge and Internet Explorer. Thank you for watching and see you later.